All right, I have a solid 15. Whoa, check that out. What's up, Detector Mo here. I'm gonna go try my luck on the beach. Uh, I know it's been a few weeks since I hit the beach. I've been doing a lot of uh, relic digging lately, but <clears throat> early morning, low tide in about an hour. Yeah, about an hour from now. So I'm here on Holden Beach, try my luck, and uh, stay tuned. Uh, be back on my first dig. First dig. All right, this is a iffy signal. It's showing like 15, jumping up to 17, but there's a grunt. I want to say it's probably a, a bottle cap, more than likely, but I'm going to dig it anyway, as you can see. <laughs> Oh, I finally got it out. Yep, that's what I figured it would be. A fishing sinker. Made in China. <laughs> A four ouncer.
All right, so 1920. I would probably say a Zinkin penny. It's a penny. Or maybe. Uh, it's got me fooled. It's another fishing sinker. How about a bottle cap? Yep, bottle cap. Alright, well, some more broken up trash. All right, I have an iffy signal here again. Reading about a one, it's jumping up to 17, so it's all over the place. Probably trash. Oh, look at that. I have a appendix. Looks like uh, a diving pendant. Somebody's diving. That's pretty cool. There's no markings. Uh, I believe it's just junk. Not gold, I believe. Anyway, that's pretty cool. Okay, right there is where I found that pendant. Making my swipe back and forth. And right here, I have a 15 and it's jumping up to 18. Maybe it could be the chain. <laughs> I don't know. We're about to see. I don't think so. Ah, I see a piece of string. And it's a fishing weight. A three ouncer. Alright, I have a 20 and it's jumping up to 24 and it sounds pretty deep. Usually deep targets and dry sand is trash. I don't know. Probably a dime. Yep, it's a dime. Oh well. All right, this one's ringing uh, solid 29. I'm gonna say it's a quarter. Yep. Oh yeah, it's a quarter. Alright, this one's a solid 13. Yeah. Huh. Sounds iffy now. Another pendant. 
that's pretty cool again I don't see any markings where is the chain to these pendants I'm finding ah pretty cool symbol all right there it is a pool tab first of the day ah broken up trash junk a oh, pool tab that's ringing pretty high uh that's a copper something trash all right you guys see that that is very dangerous a fishing hook right on the surface i don't like seeing that Ah, it's like a little tiny broken piece of rivet. How about a bottle cap? All right, I have a solid 15. Whoa, check that out. I have another. Ah, I don't see any markings. <laughs> uh, like a, a, a sword with a little diamond and a guy, one of those uh, knight's helmet. Yeah, this was a pendant. I wonder, why can't I find a chain that went to these pendants? Ah, oh, man, that is pretty cool uh, Okay guys, I finally made it home and it's time to show the wrap up. The stuff I found today on the beach. Like always, start off with the trash. Pool tabs, bottle caps, and other junk. Okay, start off with this part of a rivet. It's probably trash too. <laughs> Three fishing sinkers. A four and a three ouncer, and I don't know what ounce this is, probably a three. <laughs> 30 cents in clad, and three pendants. Looks like a diver's pendant, some kind of symbol pendant, and a sword and a knight's helmet type pendant with a heart. Pretty cool. Uh, I don't think they're real. There's no markings on any of them, so it's probably just custom junk jewelry. Well, anyway, guys, that's my wrap-up today's beach hunt. I hope you enjoy, and thanks for watching.